Admittedly, this outcome was unforeseen. I obviously didn't mean to draw all of these things here. Undead. Who could have imagined? It's not a very scientific term, but as something that is immediately recognizable to even the layman, it will do for now. From what I can gather, the Fountainhead's electromagnetic field has clashed with another extremely powerful signal, and it caused this strange reaction. No matter. It only means that I need more data to properly calibrate the machine to, this, uh, to the unfamiliar nature of this current iteration of the biosphere. I've not been idle. My scans, the data dumps that I've initiated, have told me something very interesting. Apparently, there are others out there. I have to admit that I am impressed. None of our projected numbers told us that anything as advanced as human life would survive, and yet, the tenacity of the human spirit, I suppose. I have to impress upon you that even your infant society is an amazing accomplishment. And now I can help you advance to throw off the burden of ignorance and actually build something. Carts that pull themselves, tools that create heat without open flame, things you cannot possibly imagine. Bring me the biological samples from the lab sites, and I can give you such great treasures. Research notes and technical drawings, metal and minerals, the building blocks of an infant society. Such an endeavor is too lofty for me to explain to every common person. The, the glory of our goal is too bright and just too brilliant to cloudy with an uneducated person's lexicon. So send me your princes, your primarchs and your principles, so that I might speak to them and we can reach an accord. Whichever group brings me the most samples will have my dedication and my science. We are going to build something amazing together.